TCO, we are celebrating National Jerky Day. So Jack Link's executive chef, Wes Kostelski, is here to show us how to get creative in the kitchen with jerky. Now, with I, I, jerky. I, I ate it straight out of the bag. That's I, the easy way to do it. This is a little easier. bit more creative, and I think it'll you'll, you'll feel a little more satisfied if you try something like this. Okay, so pizza seems pretty obvious. You can put anything on mm -hmm. a pizza, and it's good. Uh, but you were saying that the fat in the pizza actually changes kind of the texture yeah. of the jerky mm -hmm. itself. Absolutely. So what happens is the jerky itself kind of rehydrates, sucks up that fat, and it makes it a little bit more tender, but then emboldens the actual flavor itself. Mm -hmm. So when you actually bite into this, this uh, piece of jerky on top of your pizza, you get up like a much more intense flavor from it. Mm. Mm. And it's great. It's, it's simple and easy. I mean, grab your favorite pizza crust, throw jerky on it, and you're good to go. Now, jerky can sometimes be hard to eat. So when you put <laughs> it on a <laughs> taco like this, how are we supposed to eat that? Does, that? does it work well? Well, taco is, yeah, it's just hand. It's finger food. It's, hand, you know, it's not something you need to look pretty eating. You know, it's, it's a taco. So, I mean, it's, and it's great, too, because this is a fried avocado taco. Okay. So, you're going to get that nice kind of textural contrast between the jerky mm -hmm. and the uh, fattiness of the avocado. Okay. But again, like, have fun with it. It's a taco. Yeah. And th is this a quiche or what is this? Oh, uh, that is mac and cheese. Oh, mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Somebody that knows their mac and cheese. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So, this is a cast iron baked mac and cheese with original jerky. Mm -hmm. What I've also put in there is uh, three kinds of cheese uh, made of basic bechamel and a little bit of parsley just to give it some color. So, mm -hmm. when you hit into it, you just get that gooey, cheesy greatness. And again, rehydrates that jerky and provides a better, uh, different eating experience. Now, uh, of all these options, favorites. which does Sasquatch prefer? Is it, now your hair is in it. Now we can eat that. Uh, I right. try to keep them out of the kitchen. I know, just hair everywhere, constantly sending back food. Uh, all right, so these make sense to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But we also have a cocktail. Cocktail. This makes of no sense to me. And I don't see jerky floating in it, so I'm confused how it's involved. <laughs> and I, I did hear, I did see you take a little sip. I just, well, I know, I, I smelled it. Saying, All I did, so, it was, did it have the jerky taste to it? A little peppery. A little pepper. That's it, pepper what is jerky, it? yeah. That's nice. So what it's a it? pepper jerky vodka infused uh, lime gimlet. Mm. So essentially, all it is is taking pepper jerky, infusing it uh, for about 24 hours at uh, room temperature, and then mixing in a little uh, lime juice and simple syrup, shaking it over an ice cube. You get that smoky flavor mm. to it. That's a mommy well. punch, yeah, right? Okay. Yeah, it's kind of interesting, right? It's a chef word. I'm going to say smoky. <laughs> uh, <laughs> if people want to get free beef jerky today, they, they can do that, right? National Jerky Day. That's how we're celebrating. So, you know, feel free. Go by the uh, Wildside store. Okay. Right by uh, uh, in the Target Center and grab a free bag of jerky. All right, why yeah. not? And then make up some mac and cheese or yes. some tacos. Whip up mac and cheese, <laughs> tacos. I'm thinking this could just work as a garnish too, like a <laughs> Bloody Mary or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah absolutely. Yeah. yeah, I mean, and you can eat it traditionally out of yeah, the bag. Straight out of the bag. Too, however in you the car. Uh, if you want to try these recipes, we do have them on our website mm -hmm. as well, so you can check those out at wccocom links. Well, thanks. Yeah, thanks thank very you. much. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it. So tomorrow, I'm in.